Hi, welcome to this week at the Smith River Sports Complex. My name is Amanda Gray and today I have with me Patrick Francisco who is the facility manager out here for the sports complex and he works with Kevin Kovac and they keep our fields up to an excellent condition for our community members. And Patrick, can you give us a little bit of information about what y'all do for the fields? Uh, going through the fall months other than routine maintenance which involves mowing, trimming, etc. Uh, you got the leaf removal and uh, a lot of pruning going on as well as painting for various different events that are coming up. That's basically. So today you have to paint fields for PYSL. How many fields do you have to paint? Uh, there will be one full field on field one, four smaller fields on field two, and two smaller fields on field three, which all together equals seven. So that keeps you pretty busy throughout the day, right? About three and a half hours. All right, so if you see them around, make sure you say, hey, thank you for doing such an excellent job out at the sports complex. Recently, we have had perfect weather for you to come out here and run, jog, walk, whatever you need to do. We have various trails and different courses that you can take at the Smith River Sports Complex. And it's also amazing because you can bring your family and enjoy the fall leaves changing. We have a gorgeous scenery for you out here. And Brittany likes to come out here with her family quite a lot. And what do they like to do? They like to do everything, of course, mostly. I had three little girls all under the age of six, so mostly they like to go to the playground, but every now and then I convince them to actually walk a lap with me to get a little exercise, run some energy out of them, see the pond, swing on the swings by the pond, and then go have nap time. That's a great like point. A lot of people don't understand, when you walk down towards the pond, there are these full like amazing swings for you to take advantage of and it's just fun for the kids it's where you can sit down and relax after a hard jog and it's just gorgeous scenery when you're down here by the river and by the pond so please come out here as always you can take a look at our kiosk which hosts our map that tells you the distances that you can go on and while you're taking advantage of walking make sure you walk down the gravel access road which is when you first come into the complex by the maintenance facility and you can go down to the smith river it's so gorgeous down there you can go on the observation deck have a picnic with your family and we look forward to seeing you out here so whenever you come out to the sports complex with your family to watch an event participate in a birthday party or just any activity that you're doing you can always keep your kids entertained by bringing them to our evos and wevos play system out here and as we talked about last week we have a very soft spongy surface so it's very safe for the kids and earlier we were talking with Brittany about how she enjoys bringing her kids out to the sports complex so Brittany, can you tell me what your kids' favorite things to do out here on the Evos and Wevos play system? Um, their favorite thing, I have a six, a four, and a one-year-old, and the four-year-old is the most active, I would have to say, and she is not really big enough yet, but her favorite part is to climb up this, and she wants to try to weave in and out, and she's not, she's finally getting there, and the great thing about it is that she's not big enough to do it yet, but with this surface, she can fall as many times as she wants, and she's not going to complain the first time. Be sure to give us a call for any of your rental needs, whether you want to have a birthday party out here, a family reunion, you're celebrating a baby shower or an anniversary, or if you just want to use our fields for any reason that you can think of, give us a call at 638-5200. We'll get you set up. And right now we're in a picnic shelter that's right beside our Eva's playground. So less than 10 yards away, you could be eating with your family and then watching your kids and making sure they're staying safe. But Brittany loves it out here and she has had quite a few birthday parties out here. What is um, Maya? She's had three mm -hmm. birthday parties out here. Yes. What does she like about it? Um, her favorite part is this. There's two little speakers on the playground and her and Cadence or her and another family member can go to the speakers and talk to one another and hear each other. But like Amanda already said, it's great for any kind of kid event because you can come and you can set up and you can bring everything in all while they play because you can see the parking lot if you're unloading your car, you can see the shelter and you can see the playground. You can set up on the shelter while they play and then call them over when you need them. So it's a very open area and as we um, stressed before, you can bring any kind of um, food that you would like to bring in, whether you wanna cater it or make it yourself. That's entirely up to you and we will help you with anything that you need. We have a lot of events coming up this weekend for our community members starting on um, Saturday at 8 o'clock we're having our Piedmont Youth Soccer Recreation League playing all day. Then we're going to have our their PYSL travel teams playing throughout the day as well and also on Saturday we're having our Southside Youth Football League. They're going to be taking on the Walkertown Wolfpack starting at 11 and they're going to be playing all the way up until 6 or 7. Coming up on Sunday we're going to have the PYSL travel teams playing as well and then we're also going to have the Henry County Adult Flag Football League playing and Southside Youth football games are going to be continuing as well so please come out and support your local team